Does the concept of rhyme make sense when describing music? We're all familiar with the concept of lyrical rhymes. For example, the words through, comma, curfew, and blue all rhyme despite being spelled differently because the sound of their final syllable is the same. But if you're analyzing instrumental, i.e., non-verbal music, does it make sense to say that two musical phrases rhyme? Consider the opening of Beethoven's Fifth Symphony. Enter image description here. Could you say the second four-note phrase rhymes with the first? If we can agree that rhyme is a helpful musical term, what might the rules be? For instance, in the Beethoven example, if the second phrase ended with a leap up to AD rather than down to AD, would that still be a rhyme? Or is rhyme too vague and ill-specified to be useful as a term of musical analysis? By the way, I did try Googling for this but got lots of hits related to songs for small children, rather than technical terminology for musical analysis. That particular choice of two four-note phrases I think doesn't rhyme particularly well. The first sequence goes G G G E flat down a major third, the second goes F F F D down a minor third, and the rhythm varies too. But if I have understood correctly, you might be referring to cases where there is a more direct mapping between phrases, for example if the second phrase maintained all the intervallic relationships, but modulated to a different key. In that case, I think we call it a sequence. Here's the Wikipedia link, https colon slash slash en dot wikipedia dot org slash wiki slash sequence. Music. I actually wasn't aware of this until I googled modulated ostinato and clicked around. We would have typically called this a motif repeated musical idea or an ostinato type of motif where a melodic line in same voice is repeated if it weren't for the change of key. To be fair, there is a lot of ambiguity in differentiating between some of these concepts. Consider the Encyclopedia Britannica's definition of ostinato, short melodic phrase repeated throughout a composition, sometimes slightly varied or transposed to a different pitch. The words sometimes slightly varied or transposed are interesting. Under this definition, ostinato entirely captures the definition of a sequence. So to summarize, depending who you ask this could be called a motif, an ostinato or a sequence. That being said, because the example you gave has two fairly distinct four-note phrases, and I am finding it hard to see how they might rhyme, I may have jumped the gun, misunderstood what you were asking, and answered a different question.